Now to a horrific case of animal cruelty. It has authorities in Harris County desperately looking for the person responsible. Yeah, a dog was shot with a bow and arrow. This happened on Sunday on Cheeves near Tidwell and Homestead. That's where we find our David Gonzalez, who has more on this investigation. Hey, David. Sherman and Len, yeah, that dog that they fondly named Archer was actually found on a porch on the street back on Sunday. And investigators say whoever did this did this on purpose. And they say that there are, he's a threat or she's a threat to this community. We want you to take a uh, look at this video, but at the same time, we want to warn you because some of the images in the story may be too graphic for some. His big brown eyes show his fighting spirit after going through what his rescuers called unimaginable cruelty. This little guy they named Archer, giving it his all after being shot with a bow and arrow. He was found on this street on Sunday before being rushed to Texas A&M. When we were transporting him to A&M, he originally started off laying in the back seat of the volunteer's car. And even with the arrow in his back, he crawled into the front seat, laid next to her and put his paw on her. X-rays show the arrow penetrated Archer's thorax, diaphragm, abdomen and liver. This graphic picture shows the condition the small 24 pound dog was found in. The people that do these kinds of things to animals are a danger to the community. Now deputies in the Harris County Animal Cruelty Task Force are searching for the person responsible. We're here to seek the public's help in identifying a particularly dangerous and twisted individual. That's the only way to describe someone who would aim a bow and arrow at a defenseless dog, draw back the string and launch an arrow into someone's pet. Authorities believe people who abuse animals are more likely to harm people. It was a sadistic act of violence, possibly committed by a deeply disturbed individual who likely poses a continued threat to our community. Vets were able to successfully remove the arrow, but sadly, Archer died during a second emergency surgery. We're devastated. There's no words to describe how we all feel at this moment. The, um, the pain, the anger, the grief over losing such an innocent animal. There's just, there's no excuse for this. Now they just hope to get justice for Archer. The Harris County Sheriff's Office says that they have never prosecuted someone for shooting a dog with a bow and arrow, but first they need to identify the suspect or suspects in this case. If you have any information, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers. Their number is 713-222-TIPS. Back to you guys. All right, thank you so much.